Hey everybody, I am Asif Khan, Shaq News Luminary, here with a look at the 1.0.4 update of Shaq Pets. Uh, as you can see, we've done some cosmetic changes. Uh, there is a new navigation paradigm here. Uh, we have moved some buttons away from the hamburger menu down to the bottom of the app. So you can navigate to the vote screen, the challenge screen, the results screen, latest pets, and my pets with one button press. Uh, this is something that we have wanted to do since launch and we've been working towards it and we're really happy to ship it with today's update. Uh, outside of that, we are updating the results page uh, with filters. So if you just want to see dogs or if you want to see completed uh, matches, you can sort by that. Uh, you can also still look at your votes. Uh, you'll notice that your votes are highlighted here. If the pet you voted for lost, you'll be able to see how many votes they got and stuff. Uh, so this is just an improved results screen. Uh, we are adding a filter so that you'll be able to filter by pet and also by completed or not. Uh, so we are working on bringing this filter to other screens on the app going forward. Uh, another thing we added is a feature called pet regret. So we have introduced a new feature uh, in settings called pet regret. Uh, you know, when you're really going, when you're trucking through this app, sometimes you may not even notice that you're voting against your own pet so clearly lola is my dog this is her birthday update of shack pets also congratulations to lola on 8,000 wins on the platform so if i vote against her i am warned by the app it says you are about to vote against your pet are you sure you want to do that and you can say no and it brings it right back just to show you again swipe left against lola are you are you sure you want to do that no lola's back so there you go. That is pet regret. On top of that, you know, uh, we are also shipping something that's hard to, to demo here. There are going to be some new notifications when you win a battle. Because right now, uh, we only notify people when they win Shack News for the day or Shack Pets for the day. Uh, we're going to notify uh, our users when you win a battle for the day. And that'll bring you to the results screen. Uh, so that's not something I can show you today, but that's another update coming out. Uh, so yeah, this is Lola's birthday update. Her birthday is this week. And we thought, why not do something cool? Uh, the big the big part of the update is definitely uh, the bottom navigation row of buttons now. Uh, you can see you can jump to your pets, you can jump to latest, you can jump to results, you can jump to challenge, you can jump to vote. And then really the hamburger menu is just for FAQ settings. Uh, and like I said, we added pet regret. We still have safe mode. Hopefully this will help you navigate faster. And thank you uh, for continuing to use Shack Pets. We hit a thousand image uploads just this month. And we are just thrilled uh, to see people still using the app and asking for new features. And we are still working on other updates. This is just what we had that was ready to go for Lola's birthday. So we hope you like the new navigation. Uh, we hope you like the in inclusion of pet regret as a setting. And yeah, the new results screen with filters uh, are all in this latest build. So thank you for supporting us. And we will see you soon with another awesome update for Shack Pets, which is available for free on Android and iOS.